Hello, Knights fans. I'm now joined by the reigning NEC Player of the Week, Darian Anderson. Darian, having a great season thus far, second in the conference in scoring. What does winning the Player of the Week award mean to you? It means a lot. It shows that people are noticing my efforts on the court, and my team gives me that encouragement and um, confidence to be able to win something like that. It just means a lot. Yeah, I mean, you've been scoring at a great rate all season. 22 points over the first two conference games here. 26 last game against Robert Morris. What's been the key this season to getting so many buckets? It's just one of my roles. Uh, my my play, my teammates give me um, confidence day in and day out. I know I have, to, I have to come in and give big shots, and I expect the same from my teammates when I'm not having a great game. They do the same. It's my first season here getting to watch you play. One thing I've noticed, your relentless energy. I mean, end of the floor, you really seem like a catalyst for this team. Have you always had this much energy going back to the little kid all your years of playing? Yeah, it started at a young age. I've just been so competitive, and my competitive nature just drives me, and that's how I'm always able to just keep going. All right, now you got the rematch with Wagner, rematch of the NEC championship game, going back to Staten Island, their place. How excited are you for the rematch? I'm excited, but we just got to treat it as another game, come out ready to win and just – Come ready to compete. All right. Thanks for your time today, Darren. Good luck. So the Knights travel to Staten Island to take on Wagner in a rematch of the NEC title game tomorrow, Thursday night at 9 p.m. The game can be watched on CBS Sports Network. For all information about the FDU men's basketball team, head to fdunites.com.